you doing? Not too bad. Not too bad. Do you play cards? Yes, I do. You do? I just happen to have a deck of cards right here. Could you examine them closely for me? That's close enough. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Here, just take a good look yeah. at those cards. Make sure they're not unusual or nothing's funny about them. You've all heard of marked cards. Yes? Mm -hmm. yeah. That's where you can tell one card from the other by little markings on the back. Now, those cards aren't marked, are they? No. Nope. No, they look uh, perfectly... And they are perfectly normal. But I'm going to show you the newest methods of marking cards. We'll be able to tell these three cards from the rest of the deck by the newest methods of marking cards. The first method is called the gambler's crimp. It's a method of putting a little tiny bend in the back of the cards. Here we go. The gambler's crimp. Almost impossible to see. <laughs> Now, of course, you need special glasses to see this bend. <laughs> Believe me, there's a bend in the court. The next method is called the invisible notch. It's a method of putting a little tiny notch in these cards. Here we go, the invisible notch. Almost impossible to see. <laughs> now, if you read Braille, you can feel the difference. <laughs> Here we go. The final method is called the Las Vegas link. It's a method of marking two cards with one by invisibly linking it on the other two. It looks something like this. making a wish and blow it. Back together. More magic with David Copperfield. But first, a magic moment from the 